Hi, and welcome to another Cup of Inspiration. You know, I was going through a few things this weekend, and I found my father's dog tags, the ones he wore uh, in World War II. They mean a lot to me. You know, I hadn't seen them for a while, and I was uh, so overjoyed to find them and have them again and, and place them now where I know they're going to be found at any time. And I was thinking, you know, God created man to worship him, but he also gave us a free will. So men can worship him or they can go on their own way. But he created us that way. And in Romans 3.23, it says, For all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. So we were all born into sin, and he gave us that free will. But then he sent his son, Jesus Christ, to die for us. And I see Jesus following after people, going after them. And it's like he's, he's, he's going after the gifts his father put on earth. And when he finds them, he just rejoices. Matter of fact, all of heaven rejoices. It says in Luke 5.10, In the same way I tell you, there is rejoicing in the presence of the angels of God over one sinner who repents. So God, Christ is there to find you. If he hasn't found you today, all you have to do is say, God, I'm here. Jesus, I'm here. Find me. I want to be found. And he will. And I'm I reminded of the song Amazing Grace. One of the verses, it says, I once was lost, but now I'm found, was blind, but now I see. They were found by Jesus Christ. And he found that gift that the Father put on earth, which is us human beings. So today, if you haven't found Christ yet, just say a word. Say, please find me, Lord. I want to be found. Have a great day and look forward to seeing you again for another cup of inspiration. God bless.